All right, boys and girls, I'm gonna take you guys through how to do our skeleton face project. So let's start by making a nice big circle in the middle of our page. This is gonna be our skeleton face. So start here in the middle, nice and big. We don't want it to be too small. We wanna have a good size skeleton, right? So we'll go all the way around. Then I'll stop there so you guys can make your circle. Now, inside the two circles, uh, inside the circle, we're gonna make two circles for our eyes. Nice and big though. And you're gonna see why. We're gonna make these two circles really big. Make them the same size. Make them pretty big. Go ahead and do that, guys. Okay. Now inside those two circles, we're gonna do another two circles. Like this. And like this. Go ahead and do that. And then guess what? Inside those two circles, we're gonna do another two smaller circles. I promise this is the last one, guys. And then those two tiny circles we're gonna color in, but make sure you are using a black crayon, not just your pencil. I colored that in. I'll let you guys do that. Next, you guys are gonna color in this outside ring. We're gonna use our black crayon to color in this outside ring. I'll fast forward through this in the video for you guys at, in class. Those of you at home, you guys can fast forward until I'm done coloring this. Take your time when you're coloring. Don't make sure you're staying inside the lines and getting all the black area. All right, so those are our eyes. Might fill in a couple of those little white spots. Okay, so now we're going to make our nose. We're going to do a curve line like this and a straight line like that. I'll let you guys make your nose. Okay, next step. We're going to color that in as well, again, using our black crayon or black marker, whatever you're using. And there's our nose. So next, guys, we're going to make our nice smile. We're going to start here on this left side, come and make a regular smile all the way across. Now, this is a skeleton, so we're going to add some lines going up all the way up the smile. You can add as many as you want or as little as you want. We're gonna add some hair to, I know skeletons don't have hair, but we're gonna add some hair to our skeleton. So we're gonna just do some wavy lines here. Just like that. And of course we are gonna color that in as well. Turn my paper sideways to make it a little bit easier for myself. I like the color in this area first. I'm going a little fast, guys. You should take your time. Go as slow as you need to go to make sure you color it the right way. Again, we're still using our black. Only black and white so far. Now 
And there we go. So I'm gonna leave mine, mine's gonna be a boy. Now let's say you wanted to have yours be a girl. I have another one on the side here. Already ready to go. And let's say you wanted to make yours a girl and add some uh, ponytails or pigtails to yours. Let me show you what you can do. I already practiced this before too. You can make a rectangle right up here. Make sure it's with the hair. And then you can draw a line curving all the way up and curve it in like this next to the face and then up to there same thing here we'll make another rectangle on this side make sure it's on the hair and then you're gonna curve all the way up come around make a point and then bring it back around this way Of course, you guys would color that in, make it nice and dark, make the hair black, and then you would leave the little bow, uh, you would leave this part empty so you can color it whatever color you want. I'll leave that there so you guys can see it for a second. So if you wanna do a girl, you can do this one. If you don't wanna do a girl, you can leave it without the pigtails. Let's go back to our original. All right, guys, so, Next thing we're gonna do is, this is our skeleton face. We're done with this part. Now we're gonna decorate the outside and make the rest of our page look really, really nice. We're gonna do this by making some flowers. We're gonna do a flower in each corner. One here, one here, here, and here. So let's start by just doing four circles. We're gonna do a circle here, a circle here, circle here and a circle here around about the same size they don't have to be perfect so make your four circles on your page I'll let you guys do that all right guys I'm going to make one flower for you and we're gonna make one flower together and then I'll let, I'll uh, let you guys make your four flowers so what I'm gonna do for these petals is I'm gonna start at the circle and I'm gonna make just a curved flower petal shape like that. And I do another one. I do another one. I do another one. As many as it takes to get all the way around. Just like that, there's my flower. You guys can follow along or you can just go at your own pace and we're gonna make four flowers. I'm gonna keep going here. Now, if you have a different way that you wanna make flowers, you can make your flowers a different way. That's up to you. Again, they don't need to be perfect, but you just keep on going. One more. Just like that. So now I have my skeleton face and my four flowers on my page. Next, we're gonna add some streamer. I'm gonna start with a curve line here, and we're just gonna go down and make a curve line all the way until I get to this flower. I'm not gonna pass the flower though. On the same place, I'm gonna start another line and just go down the same as this line and try and stay close to the same as this line. So making two wavy lines on this side, I'll let you guys do that. Okay, moving on. Same thing up top. A wavy line from one flower to the next. 
and on the bottom another wavy line from one flower to the next that was kind of a thick one you just don't have got you don't you don't have to make it that thick and then on this side same thing I'm gonna make a wavy line connecting this flower and this flower and then next to it another wavy line connecting this flower and this flower of course we're gonna do the same thing on the bottom Made that one a little bit thinner now we have our skeleton face we have our one two three four flowers we have a streamer connecting all four flowers last but not least boys and girls you can go in and you can add whatever details you want to add you can color your flowers color your streamer the same color add some details you can add uh, markings and, and little flowers onto the face if you want anything you want to make your picture nice and colorful i didn't do too much i'll show you my finished product this is the one that i finished now you see what i did i made my the eyes inside here i made them yellow just to add a little bit of color to the face i did different colors all over my flowers i did different kinds of flowers so if you want to do uh different kinds of flowers you can do that too these are more straight lines these have points on the end you don't have to make the same flower. I also added some green vine to the side. You could add green leaves if you wanted to. I want you guys to make this decorated skeleton face your own. Make it however you want to make it. And that's it, boys and girls. I hope you have a really good time making this really cool skeleton project.